It's the kind of beat to go. Hey guys, what's up? It's Joey, and today we're here with the zombie side of the game. And I just want to cover some of the new stuff that came out with 2.1 on the zombie side. And pretty much just play around with them because I just haven't played with them in a while and I miss them. So, probably one of the biggest things for me personally. Most of the stuff is going to be the same, but probably the coolest thing for me, at least me personally, is the things they're doing with the Undertaker and the Mortician. I believe that's what it's called. And it's this perk right here Parasitic Invasion. Parasitic. I don't even know how to say that. Parasitic. Parasitic Invasion. Take over human squad points. So, they will be able to convert those blue pads to zombie spawn points for me. And that's actually really cool. So that's what happens when you hit level 10. And I'm just going to slowly work my way up there to level 10 right now. And I'm just going to keep on upgrading because I really want that perk. It's just going to really change gameplay, how things work. And I'm actually really looking forward to using it. It's going to be really cool. So right now I'm actually leveling it up to level 2. About 55 seconds left on that. It's going to be a couple minutes, but we're just going to let it go. So while that is going, pretty much the only things that are changed is they've added these new level icons above all of the characters, similar to what they did in the survivor side. And really not too much things that are different. Everything is basically the same. Everything's just looking sick. These resource collector stuff is actually so cool. It's really cool. I like it. Couldn't say it anything else. Right now I'm going to get that drone geyser going because the drone guys are sick. All right. Evolve. How much time we got left? 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13. We're not going to wait that long. So let's see. Let me make sure I got my squad ready to go. All right. I like these reanimators. That one's level 5. I'll take that. Level 11. Perfect. Shaktor Zambuit. I'll take that. Titan Biohazard uh, Puddler, I believe. Do you have anything else that's like higher level that I could bring along? Cesspool. Cesspool is coming with. And let's go ahead and complete this upgrade and once we get to level three resurrect possibly 240 percent faster so that'll be nice but let's complete that e evolution right there it's pretty sick all right level two sweet stamina recharged didn't even use it it's already charged but hey i'll take it and i'm gonna go ahead and actually start leveling that up to three that's gonna be taking 10 minutes so that's probably gonna go over the rest of this video but it's fine so let's go ahead and fight and check out a PvP match because I'm interested, I'm interested to see how it looks on the zombie side. I'm sure you guys are too. It's got to look. This is kind of for those zombie players right now. So let's uh, borrow this biohazard and start it up. Let's see who we're going to get matched up with. Bongers, 558th place. That is not very good. I'm just going to be honest with you right there. So he has his stuff placed. We're at 5% battery life. So this is going to be like the only one attack we're going to be doing right now. But hey, it's all good. Uh-oh. What we're going to do? What we're going to do? All right. So here's what I'm going to do. Shaktor Zambowitz. He is going to be heading on over in this direction. He's going to get a little horde right there with a Titan up front. Him plus a bunch of biohazards. They're just going to chill out. And over here, we're going to do something similar. We're going to just drop the rest of these drones right over here. We're probably going to overwhelm these guys. But hey, I'll take it. I will take it. We're just going to keep rolling with these guys. Let's throw in some biohazards. Why not? So we are just rolling. The that Titan is just taking damage right now. He's just rolling. He's not even losing any health. He's killing it. So, Shaktor Zombowitz, Titan, all of them, they're just wrecking. These biohazards are killing it. They're pretty sick. So, are they able to... Okay, so it looks like the biohazards... That's another thing. Biohazards are going to be able to do a very tiny amount of damage. Nothing too crazy, but enough to be actually doing something. So, let's go ahead and stim up these guys. Boom, we took out... Got to take out little tiny humans. No big deal. Biohazards are dropped instantly. Looks like we took out that area over there as well. And I'm not going to drop any reanimators because I feel like we, we got this handled pretty well. We just got to take out this one sniper, a couple contractors, a sniper, and outlaw, and that is done. That is it. So, uh, down goes the sniper. Let's go ahead and stun with these biohazards and we just get them juiced up. We just knock out these guys really fast. Down they go. Easy peasy. Not even a problem. So, that's pretty cool. Very similar to the survivor PvP. Nothing too crazy. Fun stuff. I like it. I just really wanted to show you guys kind of how that compared and what it looked like, basically. 
see how it differed from the survivor side because i know some of you guys are zombie players so you guys are interested in that so fighting okay i'm gonna do one more quick attack and that's gonna call it a day Whew. it'd be really funny if i got matched up with myself that'd be crazy that actually be really funny actually all right this is gonna be a speed attack i'm going to be dropping can i drop okay we're drawing a super amount I'm going with two hands right now and you can go over there y'all can go over there you can go over there titan you can go over there uh let's put some reanimators down here why not put one there put one there i'm just like throwing down everything right now because we're trying to power through this level as fast as possible and we got 32 so it looks like biohazards can cause damage with their whatever they call it two buildings that little aurora around them i don't really know how to call it what to call it well that was easy i could probably power up i could probably power through pretty high through the levels here but i'm not going to be playing too much because the ipad is just about to die but that's going to call it a day for this episode guys hope you guys enjoyed that's pretty much the basic gist of what's happening on 2.1 in the zombie side we're going to start getting back to some of those normal super fun videos y'all always like but guys thanks so much for watching i will see you guys in the next episode see you guys